If you're asked to determine how many ions are in K2SO4, here's how you figure that out. So first off, we have potassium, that's a metal, and then the sulfate here, that's a group of nonmetals, SO4. You have a metal and nonmetals, that's going to be an ionic compound. We need to think about the charges. So potassium, that's in group one on the periodic table, and all of those elements are going to be one plus. So we have two of these, and each one will be one plus. For the SO4, you just need to memorize that SO4, that's the sulfate ion, and the whole thing has an ionic charge of 2 minus. It's a polyatomic ion. So now we can see that we have 2 times 1 plus, that's 2 plus, and that balances out the 2 minus. So the net charge is 0. This is an ionic compound. So to figure out how many ions we have in K2SO4, we'll have two of these potassium ions, which are 1 plus, and then we'll have just one of these sulfate ions, SO4, 2 minus. So 2 plus 1, 3. There are a total of three ions in K2SO4, two potassium ions and one sulfate ion. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.